Thank you very much. Um, there's a lot of uh, ignorance going on in our communities, and um, my always belief was we can't wage war all the time. And my personal belief is we need to wage art, and poems are my artillery. So I'm going to share an infomercial with you guys that I wrote for ignorant people. Are you suffering from terrorism? Do you wake up in the morning, afternoon, or night seeing Asian? Are you fearful of Mexicans and borders being placed in the same sentence? Does the smell of curry remind you of body sweat? Do you find yourself clutching your purse and walking past a black guy? If so, you may be suffering from what is known as ignorance. I and the people I get with it as 2014 would like to announce there is a cure. We understand that ignorance is a serious illness that affects teenagers and adults alike. It does not discriminate, however, the people suffering do. In North America alone, there is said to be nearly 200 million people that live with ignorance. Unlike other illnesses, people who are surrounded by ignorance often receive what is called unnecessary animosity generating resentment syndrome, or for short, mad hate. So I, the people I get with it is 2014, would like to present a cure to ignorance that is natural, affordable, and has been around for centuries. Knowledge. <laughs> And knowledge has been proven to release severe cases of ethnocentrism, racism, and has been extremely effective in removing certain stereotypes. If you suffer from illiteracy, sexism, homophobia, others, make sure to contact your local librarian and read the necessary text required before moving on to higher concentration of knowledge. Be sure not to mix knowledge with conspiracy that effects are unknown and have yet not been proven. When consuming knowledge, see quiet space, finish knowledge direct, do not step unless otherwise stated. See, me and my partners that get with it as 2014 can guarantee knowledge works, but we just can't guarantee it's you, so here are a few testimonies. You want to know what? I always wonder why black people love chicken and watermelon so damn much. <laughs> but thanks to knowledge, I don't waste my time on silly things that taste good because they do taste good. I focus on how the government can help me provide for my kids. Um, hi, um, I've always wanted to bomb Iran. Um, knowledge helped me realize I didn't even know why Iran was, <laughs> but now I do. But thanks to knowledge, I don't want to bomb them anymore. Side effects include tolerance, understanding, appreciation, include risk or generosity is not foreseen. Love and pride are rare, but have been noted in some cases. Other side effects include the mind being completely blown as to how you've never realized life without ignorance. Ask yourself if knowledge is for you. If so, do everyone at this forum a favor and get some. Thank you. Yeah.